How do mortars actually work? If you've seen a war film, then you've seen a mortar in action. But if you ever thought that operating one of these things was as simple as plopping it on the ground and pointing it in the direction of the enemy to let loose some rounds, then you'd be dead wrong. Mortars themselves are a straightforward weapon system. They are comprised of just a tube to guide the mortar rounds, a base plate to ignite the primer, some vertical stands to help stabilize it, and a sight to aim the weapon. However, actually firing and aiming the weapon includes the mortar team and the fire control center, the section chief, and the forward observer working with the ground troops. The team has to place reference sticks out ahead of the mortar to aim it, and these are then used to create a reference point. When the troops in contact call for fire, the fire control center uses this reference point and some trigonometry to start lobbing shells at the enemy. Once the forward observer adjusts the fire and is satisfied with it, the team can then fire for effect and destroy the target.